Hey YouTube, it's Jamin Nice Knight here. I'm gonna do a quick video. I'm gonna review some Slam 1999 and out of the body experience. It's like a body underline because Jesse the Body Ventura came and was a special guest in the WWF title match. Alright, and went to the results. Because I don't think I've done this very much on all the reviews. Edging came. And Christian versus the Hardy Boys versus Midian and Viscera versus Draws and Prince Albert versus the Acolytes versus the Hardcore Hollies. I don't know why they couldn't just put the Hollies. There was a tag team turmoil match for the the winner got a uh, tag team title match. Like it was for the number one contender spot. And then women's championship match, Ivory versus Tori. I don't, I don't, I don't think I paid attention in this one because women's matches are boring most of the time. Especially Ivory, she's very boring. But I think she retained the title. A Lions Den weapon match that was awesome. Ken Shamrock versus Steve Blackman. What that match was was like a UFC ring with weapons at the top of it. Because Ken Shamrock used to be like a UFC guy, and Steve Blackman always liked using these like martial arts weapons, like kendo sticks, nunchucks, and all that stuff. Two titles on the line, the European and the Intercontinental. D'Lo Brown had won the titles from Jeff Jarrett, or he had, he won the Intercontinental title from Jeff Jarrett, so he had them both. And uh, Jeff Jarrett won the match. Because Mark Henry came out and like did like the world's strongest slam on him when the ref was down. Uh, the tag team title match. Kane and X Puck lost the titles to Undertaker and Big Show. Undertaker and Big Show dominated Kane and X Pac in that X Pac in that match. The hardcore title match. Big Boss Man versus Al Snow with Pepper. And Pepper is his little dog thing. Like, I guess he quit carrying around the head and brought Pepper with him. <laughs> I guess, I don't know. Because I was little when all this happened, so I don't remember too much. Yeah, this uh, hardcore championship match went outside into a bar and they started fighting onto a pool table. Then it went into the bathroom of the bar. It was It was funny. Some parts were. And then a kiss my ass match, The Rock versus Mr. Ass. Uh, the Rock won. And Mr. Ass brought out this really ugly, nasty looking fat old lady. Fat. Ugh. And he was going to make The Rock kiss her ass. And The Rock won, so he, Mr. Ass had to kiss her ass. It was weird, but. And nasty. Love her or leave her. Greenwich Street Fight Test versus Shane McMahon. In this match, Lover, Lever, Grant, Sweet Fight, it was about snapping McMahon. If he, if Test won, he could stay with her, and if he lost, he had to leave her alone. And Test ended up winning. And Stephanie McMahon came out running, and she was like hugging and kissing him. The triple threat match for the WWE Championship match Stone Cold Steve Austin versus Triple H versus Mankind. With Jesse the Body of Ventura at special guest of Free Mankind. Who's that winning? These are all pretty good matches, except for the women's match, because that match was boring. And I gave this pay per view a 9 out of 10. It was pretty good. You got I got this a good reel for $1. So, see what going to thrift stores and stuff like that can get you. Cheap wrestling movies. And my VCR is about to go off because I'm rewinding Survivor Series. So I like to try to rewind my movies before I put them back on the shelf so you'll hear like a noise. I think. Yeah, that was it. If you had that. So, yeah, I recommend this to anyone that liked that. These are all good matches. So, except for the women's match again because they suck. Their matches are boring most times. So, yeah, that's about it. Don't comment, raise, subscribe. Bye.